80 cakes um it is so hot i could not move the camera any further down than this okay look i <laughs> i've got boxes on and like new trousers so sorry nudity <laughs> i just kind of wanted to do like a quick update video because i'm home alone and need to talk otherwise i will literally go insane and start talking to myself like my next door neighbor is doing right now you can hear him Wailing. <laughs> so what is going on in my life that i haven't told you guys about um the other day um it was like three days ago now um i went into cardiff and i had an amazing time i went on like this doctor who themed tour around cardiff with my dad and it was super fun and i was totally geeking out of, of all of like the locations um but i did actually know a little bit more than the tour guide did uh, no my camera fell Let's just pretend that didn't happen, right? I did actually know a bit more than the tour guide did and he made like a few mistakes and I was like gonna correct him but I was like, no, that is too nerdy and rude. You don't correct people. You just shut your nerdy ass up and just try and forget about it even though it makes you extremely uncomfortable because you know more than the tour guide. <laughs> and also while I was in Cardiff, I met up with my internet friend, Meg, and we went and got like a latte and had a bit of a chat. And like, it's only the second time I've ever met up with her. The first time I met up with her was like when we first ever started talking and that's how like we got to know each other. And cause she lives like in Wales and I live like down in like, the middle of England by Birmingham. And we like literally never get to see each other. So we're like pretty much internet friends. And it's just super cool that I got to catch up with her in person. Um, yeah, and she was with a couple of her other friends who like I haven't ever met. And they were pretty chill too. And yeah, that was all fun times and um, it's amazing. If you guys have internet friends who you haven't met up with ever or don't meet up with that often, you should go check them out. My finger looks huge. You should, you should go check them out, meet up with them because it's really, it's a lot more fun to be able to talk to your best friends in, in the face other than just messaging them. But make sure they're not pedophiles first, obviously. <laughs> Um, so I watched Warcraft the other day, you know, that film about orcs and humans, it's like half CGI, it's really weird. And I was going to do a review on it, but I realised, like, I literally got nothing from that film. It was just a whole load of, like, CGI armies fighting other CGI armies. Literally the only thing I learned from that film is how attractive Dominic Cooper is, but, like, I knew that already. He's, he's just so pretty. It's... It's the only thing I really care about that film. <laughs> the other day while I was in Asda, I think, or Walmart if you are American, um, I got these super cool Captain America socks which are just laying on my bed next to me. Um, I got like a whole packet of Marvel socks but these are the only ones that I haven't worn yet. The rest are like dirty on my bedroom floor, I'm not going to show you those ones. And also, like, you want to see something really cool? I've got this. Alright, I know it's like aimed at like five year old boys, but <laughs> look how cool it is. I took my snacks to the cinema in it and there's still a few left in there. Cool. <laughs> I'm eating them later to be honest. Talking of Marvel stuff, I was literally just reading this Black Panther comic. Um, my brother got it me. Well, like he gave it to me. It used to be his. I, I don't know how old it is. I think it's pretty old to be honest, but it's super cool. Black Panther is my fave right now. I've been at school today and my head of house is still having a go at me about my hair. Um, you know, I was in isolation for like a week and then we broke up for a week. And then today was the first day back and I just went to class like normal, like my hair's faded a bit, whatever, like whatever. Like she probably should have got over it by now, but like she, she just hadn't. <laughs> like I was in lesson like normal and like all morning and then at the beginning of the afternoon I went into assembly and I saw my head of house there and she's the one who's really muddy about it and she was like just say you need to be back in isolation and I was like what the hell just get over it <laughs> Jesus Christ and um, so then I managed to convince her that if I pin my hair back like up there sometimes like you can't see as much of the bluey greeny bit and it looks pretty much black um, and she said I can go in class as long as I'm doing that and I'm like it really doesn't make any difference it's still there 
and there's Jesus Christ that's annoying me. So now I've got to have a massive big shiny forehead out, otherwise I'm not allowed in class. If you're wondering what that figure is there, it's actually just a Bieber cardboard cut out. I don't know why I have it. Look at it. I don't even like Justin Bieber. But so I'm going to go now because I think that the man who lives next door thinks that I'm trying to start a conversation with him or something. Um, see you guys in the next video. Please subscribe, like and comment, check out all my links in the description. Bye guys!